Hello friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. And we are on July 5th, 2021. And welcome to another surviving day on the planet and welcome to the Volcano Activity Report. And we're going to start out here looking at a newly formed mud volcanic island. And this happened overnight in the Caspian Sea after a large explosion was observed. And look at that, the center of this is still on fire. So massive mud volcano erupts in the Caspian Sea and either forming a new island or it looks like it made an island bigger. It looks like there was a little bit of an island there already. So huge eruption. I'm not sure exactly where that was, but also looking at footage here, the Gulf of Mexico, they're saying that a gas line exploded in the Gulf of Mexico yesterday, July 4th, a fiery day across the planet. Just unreal footage coming out of the Gulf of Mexico. Look at that. They're saying it took about five hours to put that fire out. And it kind of looked similar to that little fire in the center of that island. Here is the massive explosion caught on camera over the Caspian Sea. Huge fiery plume sent into the stratosphere. And I'm sure just massive underneath mud volcanic flow. Unreal footage coming from across the planet over the last 24 hours. As they say, a fiery July 4th. I'm not sure exactly even where this mud volcano erupted. Not giving the coordinates on any sites that I've seen. But this is the Caspian Sea. And I'm thinking it was right by Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan. That little peninsula, Baku. I'm thinking that's where it was because that is the only area that has dormant volcanoes. So maybe there's a small extension here into the peninsula, which would not surprise me. Let's have a look at the volcano activity report. We do have an active and erupting 45 volcanoes across the planet. And that is a decrease from last week's report by three. But we do have a couple new ones to talk about, pointing out the stressed regions over the past week. This is week 26. We are at the halfway point in 2021. Some pretty sizable eruptions, Etna and as well, Fagradas Folly in Iceland. Pretty good eruptions, Tal Volcano as well, Bagana. But interesting events happening at Caspian Sea, Gulf of Mexico, and increased seismic activity through the Dominican Republic. Let's get to all the volcanoes. Popo in Mexico, and as well, Santiaguito, Fuego, and as well, Pacaya. Awakened Talica, Strato Volcano, as well Masaya, and Recon de la Veja. Also Soufrière, St. Vincent continues to erupt. Nevados de Ruiz, through Colombia, and as well Reventador and Sangue. Down here to Sabancaya. Then down into Chile. Nevadas to Chilean. Pretty sizable eruption there. Middle of June. As well, Villarica. Notable here. The Michael Volcano. Still showing signs of unrest and increased earthquake activity 
in the region recently. Over to Africa, where of course we have near Gongo and as well near Merigira. Off the coast of Madagascar here with Piton de la Fornes, Reunion Island. Earth to Ale. And then up into the Mediterranean here in Italy. Of course, Stromboli and Etna. And then the very active and huge flows, lava flows, Fagaratus Folly. Wanted to show you here just in the region to the west of the Caspian Sea. There are quite a few dormant volcanoes in the region along the coastline here, and as well just on that peninsula that I was pointing out. Over to northern Sumatra here with Sinabung Volcano and as well Carinche. Krakatoa showing signs of life this week. Anak Krakatoa. As well, Marapi. Simaru. And Larung Volcano. Active this week as well, Luatolo. Northern Indonesia here with the Ibu Volcano and as well, Dakono. And that massive eruption that happened at the tall volcano in the lake. Amazing footage coming out of there, too. Into Japan here, Sakurajima. As well, Suwisa Awakened Sarchev Peak Volcano. And as well, Ebiko Volcano. and Karamiski, and Shavalush. Notable there at Cleveland, and as well, still awakened Great Sitkin. And of course, Kilauea. Down into Papua New Guinea here, where we have Cadaver. Manam, Langila, and as well, Bagana, the Yasser Volcano, New Caledonia, and of course, last but not least, the mighty Erubis in Antarctica. And that is all of the active and erupting volcanoes across the planet. Still a continual 45 and greater over the past six months. Let's have a look at the earthquakes over the last 30 days across the planet. Just showing in correlation to all of the active and erupting volcanoes. Lots of activity coming out of Alaska. Lots of activity well, micro swarms through the United States as well. Continuing activity through the New Madrid. Let's have a quick look at air quality. This is from windy.com showing the SO2 models for the next three days. You could see that large plume coming out of Iceland as there was a large eruption. It looked like the walls caved in, and then it had an even larger eruption after that. Massive plume coming out of Iceland, spreading right down into Spain, and then parts of Russia and Eastern Europe. Just have a quick look across the planet. Lots of plumes coming out of South Africa.
overlooking South America and United States. See large plumes coming out of the trio down in Guatemala. But also huge plumes coming out of the New Madrid. Also show you models here from Null School across the planet. I hope you enjoyed today's video. This has been the Volcanic Activity Report for Week 26. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit that like button. Hit the notification bell so you are not missing an update. Much love and prayers for humanity. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your morning due. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.